Houston Garden is the scene of an important welterweight match. As Tony DeMarco, the ex-welterweight king, who lost his title last June to Carmen Basilio, takes on the highly ranked Chico Vijar of Stamford, Connecticut. DeMarco, weighing 145 and a half, is in the white trunks. Vijar comes in at 151 and a half. They spend several seconds getting the feel of each other's styles. Vijar lacks the explosive punching of the free-swinging DeMarco, but Chico is more than competent in the boxing department. Vijar is cautious of DeMarco's dynamite fists, and the 24-year-old Connecticut youth spends the first half of the round darting in and out. DeMarco hasn't been able to get set against his fast-moving target. DeMarco is the relentless pursuer and is fully aware of Vijar's supposedly vulnerable midsection. Chico was floored several times and finally stopped by Chuck Davies' solid body smashes. With a minute gone, Tony finds the range. He scores with an overhand right and Vijar is hurt. DeMarco is scoring heavily with both hands and Chico's knees are wobbly. Vijar finally ties his man up, but DeMarco is right after him. Vijar has apparently recovered. His head is cleared, and he is boxing skillfully. DeMarco catches Chico coming in with a hard left flush on the chin. And Vijar is down. Referee Tommy Rawson picks up the count. Chico's head is cleared, and he remains down for a seven count. He's up at eight and ready to meet the onrushing DeMarco. Tony is right after him looking for the knockout. Vijar is still wobbly but tries to fight back. Tony is swinging wildly now and can't seem to find the target. Vijar ties his man up and after the break scores with a left to the jaw. It isn't enough to stop Tony and the Boston puncher throws both barrels. Vijar again ties his man up, but DeMarco is ready to dish out more punishment. Vijar is game, but DeMarco has too many guns, and a left to the jaw drops him for the second time. The referee's count goes to eight before Vijar gets to his feet. Vijar is still bewildered, and DeMarco comes rushing in for the knockout. But the referee steps between them to stop the battle at two minutes and 40 seconds of the round. And Tony DeMarco scores an impressive technical knockout. Bedlam breaks loose in DeMarco's corner as Tony comes through with a victory in his first start since losing his welterweight crown. Now the hard-hitting Boston youth is ready for another crack at champion Carmen Basilio.